Hi everyone, welcome back to African Real Estate. As you all know, my name is Mongai Kehara. Today we are in Babu Estate by Craven. This is an estate that is located 55 miles from Nairobi CBD at 2 miles from Makutano. This estate contains eight three-bedroom flat-roofed bungalows and each has a print area of 150 square meters. The price of each unit is 6.5 million. By now, I know most of you are asking, Mongai Kihara, is Makutano not very far? I agree with you, it's quite far. But this developer is doing a similar estate in Keno Town. And the most interesting thing about that estate is the price. Imagine 5.99 million for such an incredible house. Interesting, right? At the introduction of the video, I told you that this estate is called Bamboo Estate. And next to me, you can see a bamboo forest. Wow. From here, I want all of you to follow me as I take you through every detail of one of these units. Each unit is built on a 50 by 100 lot and each home comes with a two car parking like this one. This hedge separates you from your neighbor and before it grows, it will give you a near also to create a rapport with everyone. And even the Bible says, love your neighbor, so why not? Let's jump inside. At the entrance of each unit, you are welcomed by this mini foyer and each home comes with a double door like this one. Let's get inside. Wow, I'm fascinated by the value that the developer is giving you. This living room comes with these three windows that give you a ton of natural light. Add incredible views. The living room comes with the higher ceilings than you'll ever need. And one thing that I want you to note about this unit is that it comes with wooden floors. And I'm very sure you love the pattern. This estate has adopted the open floor plan. And next to me, you have the kitchen. The dining area is next to it, and as you can see, it's big enough to hold a six-seater or an eight-seater dining set. The dining space comes with a wash basin, and this door leads to the laundry area. The kitchen comes with granite countertops all over, and the beauty of this space is complemented by these two windows. One of the windows is next to the sink area, and it gives you enough light as you wash your utensils. The kitchen comes with upper and lower cabinets and on top of that you have several drawers for your cutlery. Very well designed. As you can see, next to me you have this area that is set aside for your cooking stove and this space is set aside for your refrigerator and as you can see the space is big enough for a double door. The kitchens of this estate can adopt different designs. You can opt for a design like this or you can opt for a slightly smaller kitchen with a pantry. Let me take you to the laundry area. The laundry area of this home is big enough to fit your washer and dryer. The clothes area is here and next to me you have the kitchen garden that can also be used as the rest area. I like the greenery of this space. This space is left for your spiral staircase to the roof deck. Let's get back inside. From the laundry area, the bedroom area is on my left hand side. But before I show you that, I'll show you the common washroom. The common washroom comes with a wash basin at the entrance. In here, you have a water closet and all the other basic amenities. From here, I'll take you to the first bedroom. The first bedroom comes with its closet here and its washroom on my left hand side. This bedroom also comes with these three big windows. Let me show you the closet. The closet is big enough for your guests or for your children and it comes with this section part here for your foldable clothes. The closet also comes with two drawers down there. I'll show you the washroom. At the entrance of the washroom you have a wash basin and next to me you have a water closet. On this far end, you have the showering area and it comes with a handheld and a rain shower. Let me take you to the second bedroom. Okay. 
The second bedroom is slightly smaller than the first one and it only comes with one window. The bedroom comes with a floor to ceiling closet and the bathroom is on the other side. As you can see, the closet is similar to the one that I showed you in the first bedroom, but it's slightly smaller. It comes with a section part here, maybe for your shoes, drawers down there, and a space here for your hangable clothes. Let me show you the bathroom. At the entrance, the bathroom comes with a wash basin and a water closet. This is the showering area. And it comes as usual with a handheld and a rain shower. From here, I'll take you to the primary bedroom. From the second bedroom, the primary bedroom is on the far end. The primary bedroom is the biggest of all the bedrooms. The bedroom comes with these three big windows for your lighting. The closet of this bedroom covers from wall to wall and it's big enough for you and your partner. The closet is floor to ceiling and it comes with a sectioned part here. This closet also comes with two drawers down here and you have these other two spaces for your clothes. The closet comes with additional storage up there. From here, I will show you the primary bathroom. And it's here. As usual, the bathroom comes with a water closet here and a wash basin on this far end. The showering area is on this other end and it comes with all the other showering amenities and that's all about this bedroom. We have come to the end of the tour and if you are still watching, I hope you have enjoyed to the fullest. Please support us by giving us a like and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.